And oh, we are back. So, um, funny story. We lost everything. <laughs> yeah, we recorded this part, as you might notice by the playtime. We recorded like an hour long session right after the other one. And uh, <laughs> it turned out that while we got all of the video, our audio didn't record, and there's a motorcycle. Yeah, there is. Nice ass day out. <laughs> yes, it is, because it's not bloody winter anymore. Right. So, and because I was stupid and didn't cycle my saves, I had to go back through and play through the first part of the game. Thank you for that, by the way. Oh, no worries. And it took me, like, almost half the time. Like, just a little more than half the time to get there. But nothing nothing has uh, been lost, luckily. Uh, we are going to be skipping through this a little bit because we've already seen it. It's not really entertaining to go through it again, and this is kind of a boring part of the game. Anyways. Fair enough. Gotta go tell Yamma Jamma. <laughs> and we were talking about this last time, like, what the- fucking the... S on her, yup. <laughs> yeah. Did, did we discover that? No. Oh, I, God damn like, it. I think no one did. Again, like, it's- no one knows where that came from. People have had hunches, people have- I guess it's supposed to have been, like, some logo for whatever, but it wasn't. I- I forget the story. Mm. I'll have to look it up, but yeah, in short, nice. no one knows what it is. No one actually knows. Right. Had some good fun editing the other session. I actually got it down to four parts. And the door is unlocked. Is it? Oh shit, it is. How are you gonna eat people without them noticing? I don't know. Maybe they're just gonna lick them. Fair. Catch 22. Her skirt is really short, and they probably have a good view of everything. Yeah. If anyone's gonna eat her, it's me. for a dude who fights against hordes of demons on the reg with his bare fists. Oh they shoot! They don't look bare though. They look like he's got. Looks like he's got. Well, he does. There. He does use like fist-based weapons. Like he's got these little ring blades on the tips. Yeah, I was gonna say he's got like. So they're not really bare fists. I guess, but still, like just his fists. I suppose. Like, sure, he arms them with a special weapon, but otherwise... Plus he could do this, so I guess never mind. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna say, he usually does this, so, uh... Hell, he didn't even touch them. Exorcist Arrow! I haven't seen The Exorcist, is it? Really? I don't know. Exorcist Arrow! It did more to the character who has light attribute than it did to the one who has dark. Yeah. <sighs> probably something to do with like defense or whatever. Yeah, probably. Hey! Fuck you. Say that again and I'll throw the book at you. Ah! 
got some good hits in. Yeah, I guess. You should see McKenna play this game. She is a master of the judgment ring. But she's able to churn out perfect like no other. On harder rings. Right, she zoomed, like, back to her spot fast. <laughs> yeah! Fucking flash gold over here. <laughs> Got some non name brand cherry liqueur. Right. Yeah, cherry wiggle cut is a little bit of cherry, uh, UV cherry. What? <laughs> <laughs> we are not sponsored. No, we're not. <laughs> but it's good. We, you know, if we were sponsored, I wouldn't mind. Because one, that's money, two, it's a good product. <laughs> one that I'll, you know, vouch for. Jerry McGillicuddy's give us money and we'll shill your booze. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're a company just like any other. They have commercials. Again, I'm really sorry that we're kind of skipping through a lot of this dialogue, but... It can be paused. Yeah. Plus, again, it's... Eh. Like, this game gets exponentially better. Like, each each section gets better than the last, Good. more so than it did last time. Can't forget business even at a time like this. Even in the mid... Whoa. Even in the middle of the apocalypse, gotta shill. <laughs> I was actually... You haven't seen the videos yet, so I can tell you this. Like, When we first encountered the merchant, you're like, What are you buying? I, I oh, had yeah. the Resident Evil merchant just slide in. Shit. Yeah, monsters actually rarely do their full combos. They're pretty shit on the judgment ring. Must be. I mean, later monsters are, they usually do at least two of their hits, but it's honestly kind of surprising. Like, even final enemies and final bosses don't always use their full combos. There we go. Nice. Uh, unless you can do what you do best. Yeah. Heal the party. Oh, I thought you said my name. Oh, sorry. You can do what you do best, drink and fall asleep. <laughs> um, no. Idiot. So that's how confusion works. Uh, it's kind of like Berserk, where you just do random stuff, like you can attack enemies, you can attack your party. I think that's it. But if you're attacked at all, even by one of your teammates, the confusion goes away. Hmm. Nice. Unlike Berserk, where if you do run out of sanity points and go Berserk, your sanity points will continue to go down. The only way to stop that is to restore your sanity above zero. Is there a limit? Is that how far they go down? Uh, no. Oh, you're just negative to oblivion, I think. Probably down to 90. Well, I don't know. Because some characters' HP bars can go to 999, so maybe it could actually go to 999. Negative. I've never tested Unless. that. Hmm. Well. What's the lowest you've personally seen it go to? Uh, negative four? Okay. Like, seriously, you do not want your characters to be berserk. It's pretty bad. It's endless procession of fiends. Seems like it. These are all the bones you've sacrificed to him. Why hasn't he done anything with them? Oh, she has. She used the bones to make a wall that we can't just climb over. Got it. Well, surely you could use the bones. Seems like a decent little hill she's got there. Yeah. And poof! And 
I'm gone. And poof, there's the next 20 minutes of your life. <laughs> and somebody upstairs is taking a shower, apparently. personally haven't suffered that particular nuisance. Good. It's annoying. One of these days I'm tempted to blast careless whisper through the walls and see if they hear it. <laughs> Which one is that? <laughs> oh, that's what that is? I didn't know what that song is, because I could never yeah, place it when I was looking for it. Dicks. Is that just a regular ass dog? I, I didn't get a good look. It's like, covered in scales, so I'm thinking it's supposed to be like... Okay. For a moment I thought it was like a Dalmatian. Like it was just spots. Nah. It actually has a lot of magic. Oh yeah, that's, that's scales. But otherwise it looks just like a plain ass dog model. Something that's cool, and I'll show it like some other time, because we're trying to get through this quickly. This particular area anyways. Uh, there's actually a library of monsters and characters, and there's a little snippet describing their lore. Nice. Nice when games tell you things. Yeah. Nice. And again, that's like, some of them actually go pretty deep for these things that we just kind of swat away. Nice. So I will kind of harp on the fact that Alice, like, doesn't really do much aside from healing right now. Right. But, to be honest... Oh, oh shit, I think you found her. Yeah. Found you! No, you didn't. Poof! I just realized I said I to do this. Probably help. Probably... Not gonna lie, I didn't catch you at oh. the last time. Unless that was before. Who the hell is that? Oh, that's the merchant. Yeah. I at first I just saw feet on the bottom of the screen on top of the roof. <laughs> <laughs> gonna be like, what Oops. the fuck is that? I thought it popped up with the text, like, okay. Yeah, and they even uh, give snippets for all the items. But as I was saying before, like, because you can only ever have three members in your party at any given time, and you get six throughout the whole game, including Yuri and Alice. Right. Uh, not spoiling anything, but Yuri and Alice are actually two of the three that I take with me throughout the whole game. 